This is We Are the Ship, the story of Negro League Baseball, and written by Kadir Nelson and also illustrated by Kadir Nelson. Book came out, copyright date is 2008. 2009 is the year it won the Coretta Scott Award, and it's nonfiction, historical nonfiction for the genre. It has 88 pages, and it's for ages 9 to 12 with the third to fifth grade age range published by Hyperion Books the story is narrated by Kadir Nelson and the illustrations are paintings that he has painted for instance this right here just an example there's paintings throughout the the whole book probably 20 I'm guessing there's there's lots of paintings and they're all very well done Within the book, it goes through the history of Negro Leagues and how they began with the narration from Kadir Nelson and also goes through the, their struggles and then uh, beginnings and focuses on main figures in the Negro Leagues that were really good players and impacted the league also goes into detail about what these players went through with their lives and how they were affected and what it was like to play in the Negro Leagues and the type of games that they played and how they even affected the way that the Major League Baseball is today. This book is good for kids because it introduces them to not only African American history but American history because the Negro Leagues were a big part of American history and the f fact that they influenced uh, safety standards for how Major League is and it, it really sheds light on how bad racism was back when the Negro Leagues were around because it was really bad for a long time until Jackie Robinson came and changed that and for an activity I would have the kids in the class break into two parts, two, two teams, and I would quiz them on the book, and if they got right answers, they would have a chance to throw paper into a basket to get points, and I would consider those like runs in a, in a baseball game. And if you missed it, you would get a strike, and so if the first team to get three outs, so three strikes, which is nine strikes which would be equal to three outs that team would lose and then the other team would win and yeah that, that would be the activity and it's a, it's a really good book to read and it's a really interesting look because a lot of people don't know about the Negro Leagues and yeah thanks